Where have you, you know, been? Yeah, it's been a while. <laughs> it, yeah, I, 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 th I think he would be um, mm -hmm. most excited that people are honoring everything he stood for. And I know that's what he would want to say, is that we all need to participate in conservation. We can't take for granted our beautiful wildlife and wild places. And Steve really personified that childlike enthusiasm for everything. And sometimes in day-to-day -day life you lose that. But I think if he were here, he would remind us again how important it is to be a scientist, which means being curious about the world around you and wanting to make sure it stays safe and beautiful. So I, I know he would be very chuffed, very proud of the honor and um, he would definitely be wearing khaki. <laughs> we always say khaki is not just a colour, it's an attitude. For me personally, we're so lucky because we live right in the middle of Australia Zoo and that's where we've grown up. So our backyard really is Australia Zoo, our family of animals. You know, we have crocodiles on one side of our house and giraffes on the other and that's really special. And, you know, I think that on days when I just want to reconnect and reflect, I always go to our beautiful kangaroo paddock. It's this huge space filled with kangaroos and I just sit down with the roos of an evening after the zoo's closed and just spend some time thinking about life and it's kind of my place to feel closest to dad and it's really special for me. I think too Steve was such a spiritual and insightful person so when we had him he was always giving me these little gems of advice and I remember saying to him one time because he was so physically strong and we did everything together and he'd be like, you grab the motor, I'll grab the boat, we'll go to the river. And I think, great, this motor weighs the same as me, this is not easy. And I said to him one day, I wish just for like 24 hours I could be as strong as you because it would be really fun just to pick stuff up. <laughs> and he said, you know, there's different kinds of strengths. And I reflect back on that when things are particularly difficult and challenging. And I think it's true, we can all be strong in different ways. It's very important. I think Dad would have started with crikey. <laughs> this is so exciting. You know, this is truly such an honor. And the fact that Dad was such an extraordinary wildlife warrior, you know, he really reached through the television set of everyone's living room and was able to bring the message of wildlife and conservation to millions of people worldwide. To have a conservationist on the Hollywood Walk of Fame is a wonderful honor. And I think that he would be just so so excited and you know we are really happy that we're all here as a little family to be able to unveil his star and I think that he'll be with us in our hearts which is super special so we're excited we have lots of gorgeous animals who's going to be joining us we for do. the unveiling it's, gonna be, it's just gonna be a big celebration you know it's gonna be all about everything that dad loved we're gonna have some wonderful friends from here in LA and as Bindi mentioned some animal friends as well which I'm very excited about so yeah it's gonna be super fun